Hi everybody and welcome back to our Steve's Golf. Today's video is all about how the right foot and right knee are going to move in the downswing and a simple drill to help you improve your foot and knee action. So what I commonly see by golfers as a mistake in the downswing is we get a lot of what I call active right foot and the wrong knee direction as we start down in the downswing. So as the club starts down, this foot will come up very early and it'll move kind of almost completely the opposite direction to what I'd want it to. It's almost working towards the golf ball as opposed to working towards the target. Now it might not be able to move completely towards target. You might have to work on a small rotational angle like so. So it'll go down the right hand side of the fairway then towards the target. It's because of the way our body works. But I see a lot of golfers at work in completely the opposite direction. Now, if you imagine throwing a ball and trying to throw a ball with your foot and knee going in completely the opposite direction to what you want to go in, it'd be pretty hard. And you'd have to have a lot of excessive wrist extension to make the ball go straight. So what I want to do today is give you one, possibly two drills that are going to help that right foot, right knee action pretty quickly. So the first drill, and you notice I've got another club here on the floor, will be to put that club on your heel. And when you're making some swings, the idea is to keep that club on the ground. Obviously, if my foot comes up early, the foot goes to the ground. The club goes to the ground, rather. So I want to be able to make some swings where that club stays where it is. I still want the hips to move. I still want you to feel like you transfer your mass, transfer your weight, move your body weight towards target. But I don't want to do it with the knee and foot moving incorrectly. The second drill would be to put a golf ball on the outside of your foot like so, so it's wedged at an angle and rotated over. And then again, make some swings. I feel like we just roll off that ball. So both these drills are going to help that foot and knee action to work more correctly in the downswing and through impact. So let's just try these two drills. So the first one, the ball. So my foot is rotated, kind of pinnated inwards. Now I'm going to make a small swing. and just feel that my weight, my knee, move more efficiently through contact. And that was pretty much what I'd want to feel from that. The second one, we will put the club under my foot. So it's a little bit more difficult to set up. Same thing, take our setup. So a little bit more restrictive because I'm trying to keep the foot there and the club there in place, but certainly change the dynamics of how my feet and knee were working through impact, which is essentially what I want these two drills to do. So with all drills, they have their place. They shouldn't be done exclusively to change what you do because we need to be able to take it to the golf course. The best way to use drills would be to use them little and often and hit, say, five balls doing a drill, then do some normal shots. But when you're doing the drill, maybe as well vary the club and vary the target, so it becomes more like the golf course. But have a go at these two drills to improve your right knee. First of all, if identify if your knee and foot do raise up too early in the downswing, do get too much air, and do work in the wrong direction. And if so, these two drills are gonna help fix that straight away for you. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please click like down below. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do so. I've got regular content coming every single week on a variety of subjects. And please post any comments down below also of any videos you want me to cover in the future. And thank you for watching.